Welcome everybody, today we are at Marina One Residences for a very special video. Today we're going to tour a $18.9 million super penthouse, 8,000 over square foot that is on sale for you. Alright, this is a full ID unit. Everything you see here, including the lights, the carpet, the couch, the tables, they're all going to be given to you when you purchase this unit. We have a private pool, we have a sea view over there, we have a Marina Bay Sands view over there. There's nothing you can't see from this unit, this penthouse. Let's go check it out. Now we're gonna check out this incredible duplex penthouse, 8,073 square foot. Right in front of me is the private lift lobby. Over there is your sleeping area where your four bedrooms are going to be with ensuite bathrooms. This door leads to the common lift area. So this is your private space. So you can link it all the way to the rooms. We're gonna enter the living area. We're first greeted by this very grand entrance, white marble flooring tiles, a nice display cabinet over there with ornaments in gold. Right over there, your powder room for your guests. Over there is a DB box and your storage area as well. You can put your luggages. Centerpiece table over here. And right over here, look at this. This is the living room and this is one of the biggest living rooms I've ever seen. A 10-seater white soft sofa couch over here for you and your guests. Over there, you can fit another four people. Easily, this whole area can fit more than 20 people if you want to have a big gathering over here. A carpet with a very nice kind of finishing over there. Lightings provided for you. And then right on my my right is the unblocked views of the sea of Marina Bay. So on the way to the dining, we pass by this painting that is given to you and then with a nice wallpaper over there. And we are greeted by this 12-seater marble or quartz countertop over here. Everything that has been done up for you here in this unit is the top quality fit and finishings and materials and the furniture they've chosen for you is all plated very nicely. I mean, you have bronze or gold color plated spoons and forks and these ornaments in gold. And then on my left, we have the dry kitchen. This dry kitchen is fully equipped. So coming into the dry kitchen. We actually have four induction stoves and two more over here. This is both by Miele. On my left, you have a coffee dispenser, water dispenser, two ovens, um, a concealed fridge, more water dispensers here, and a wine chiller over here, all in Miele, all your toughest great appliances. So let's just check out how expensive this whole living and dining area is from this end of the dry kitchen all the way to the other end of the living area. On my left, we have come to the wet kitchen. So this is the wet kitchen where your heavy cooking is going to happen and your helper is definitely going to be the one doing all the hard chores over here and then she'll be sleeping in this room, this bit, and this wardrobe is going to be hers. Alright, we have three gas stoves here and then we have another big melee fridge over here for all your, I think your wet seafood and whatnot, right? Plenty of space for you to do your cutting. As you can see, and they have countertops here. We have a washer and a dryer, so you're gonna hang your clothes here, I guess. And then we have a WC here as well for the maid to use. All right, let's go check out the rest of the house. So if you notice on the corner of this living room, there is a couple of stairs. We're gonna find what those stairs lead to later on in the video. Right now, we're gonna check out the four bedrooms just on the, the other side of the unit. For most units, your private lift lobby is only half, but because we are the penthouse unit, it's actually two of these combined units into one. That's why this whole area is where you're gonna walk to to actually get to your bedrooms. Now we're gonna check out first the junior master bedroom, which is on my right. Coming into the junior master bedroom, we are first greeted by three panels of walk-in wardrobe. I'm kidding, there are seven, okay? Seven panels behind this door. There are two more panels here for you to hang your clothes. Cool thing is, two more here. And right over here, we enter the junior master bathroom ensuite with a nice sink and also a standing shower with a rain shower as well. Let's go check out now the sleeping area. So coming into this sleeping area, I think that they've fitted a king-size bed over here. It is very rare for a junior master to have a king-size bed. And even with that, you have two generous size side tables here with a nice backdrop. And this is all cabinetry done for you with paintings over here. But I think I will put a 95-inch TV here with my game consoles. This is where I'm going to just spend the rest of my life. Now we're going to check out the two other bedrooms that are joined by a Jack and Jill toilet. So on my left here, this one has been converted into kind of a kid's room. Right now we have a kid's kind of a mural here. We have a kid's bed here over here, a single bed. Two wardrobe panels here, big sliding doors. 
and the Jack and Jill toilet here. Similar to the Junior Master, this one enjoys a high ceiling shower, but there's no rain shower here. And now we come into the other bedroom with again two wardrobe panels over here. And then here we have a queen size bed, big enough to fit two side table again as well with these chandelier lights. Coming out of the third bedroom now, we enter this common living space for the whole family and all the rooms to kind of gather here. Over here we have this nice marble cabinet here. I will put a TV here as well for the family to enjoy, you know, movie time together. So if you've done a math with me properly, over on the other side we actually have a stairs leading up to the second floor. And over here on this side of the house, we also have another set of stairs leading up to the second floor. This spiral staircase is a secret. If you want to find out what exactly is on this second floor of this side of the house, you gotta come down for a viewing, all right? And over here, we come now to the master bedroom. This master bedroom has a full-size walk-in wardrobe. Plenty of spaces to hide your clothes and to hang your clothes, your designer clothes, his and hers over there, or just hers because we have another room over there. So this master bathroom, of course, have a master bathtub. We have a WC over there, automated one, and behind me we have his and her sink. And on my left, we have a standing rain shower as well. So all the choices for you and your partner to enjoy this master bathroom. Coming out of the bathroom and the walk-in wardrobe, we now come to the sleeping area. King size bed over here, definitely of course, because you're a master bedroom and then we have side tables over there for you again to put your stuff nice makeup counter over here but right now it's been done into display at least a 3.5 meter ceiling height over here so plenty of air space for you to breathe when you live here you want to stay in this room you want to enjoy comfort of being in a super duper penthouse what is that there's more stuff behind oh my gosh okay i did not even know that there's more rooms behind this master bedroom um, what is this place? Okay, this is another walk-in wardrobe. Okay, I did not realize that. So I've recomposed myself. Now, this walk-in wardrobe is in a tinted finishing. So when you look, it's not messy at all. It's very clean and minimalist. And then on top as well, we have another row of cabinetry for you to put your stuff that you don't really use too often. Maybe your blankets or your sheets. And then over there, we have some hanging you know, displays for your clothing, your dresses. Okay, let's go check out the rest of the house. So right opposite the common area that we were just in earlier, actually there's another room here and this would be kind of your display, your private security room where you want to display all your branded stuff. We have your Salvatore Ferragamo, your Prada bags, your ornaments and necklaces here. These are, and we also security boxes as well to actually hide your cash and your wallet and your passport or whatever. And then I guess this would be just a, a safety room. Lah. steps leading up to the second floor that I mentioned earlier of this duplex penthouse. Now we're going to find out what exactly is on this floor. So coming out of here on my right actually is the barbecue pit area for you and your guests. It's a electrical barbecue system okay so no charcoal no fire right in front of us actually they converted this space which is an empty kind of floor unit into an entertainment area and also a little gym with equipments all ready for you to use at the other end over there. Behind me is the private sauna. So actually it's a toilet and sauna that you and your guests can use if you want to have steam and then have a nice shower with a standing rain shower. On my right, we're gonna find out what's outside. So from the second floor of the penthouse, we have this private pool over here. It's more of a soaking pool for you and your guests to kind of just enjoy a sun tanning experience because if you look up, it's the open sky. And you can see that we're at the top floor so you can actually see the structure and the facade of Marina One Residences. The bronze and the gold kind of finishing from the structures. The view here is just incredible. You can see the ships, you can see the sea. Not only can you have your pool party, but also have your barbecue at the same time. So this is the money shot view right here. You can see all your cruisers kind of docking over here and then leaving into the distance nearby. On my left there, we can see Marina Bay Sands and the Singapore Flyers, Palace by the way there as well. We can see the lights flickering at night at 7 p.m. We won't be here, but you can come here if you want to have a look. Marina 
residences is in District 1. We have three MRT lines, Shenton Way MRT, Downtown MRT and Marina Bay MRT. Okay, we have Bayfront MRT as well at MBS Station. In Marina 1 residences, we also have a private concierge service to do all your concierging needs. And there's also a nice full-size blue 50-meter lab pool as well, looking up into the sky. And also we have an aqua gym and of course, a regular gym. come to the end of this penthouse tour. This took a while for sure. It's a really big house, 8,037 square foot, okay. If you like what you see here, give me a call. This is the only full ID show unit that we have at Marina One for sale. There are two other penthouses that are on sale as well, but they're empty. Currently, there's work being done to make it a ID unit, but for now, if you want a super penthouse with a fully ID unit, fully furnished one, this is the one you want to get. Okay, if you like what you see here, I'm Jonathan. Give me a call and I hope to see you here.